workouts and helpful advice. Add this video to your favorites. It will guide you when you train. Next exercise, inclined push-ups. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, perform a push-up with your knees on the ground. Keep your abs constantly tight throughout the movement to stabilize the spine. Do not strain your neck by trying to look forward. Always stare at a fixed point on the chair. Stop. Next exercise, high punch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. 5, 4, 3, Two, one, stop. Next exercise, push-ups with rotation. Three, two, one, go. If you can't, rest your knees on the ground while performing the push-up. Do not bend or curve your back during the exercise. To be able to do this, maintain your abdomen constantly tight. Be sure not only to rotate the torso, the shoulders and pelvis will move at the same time and the arm should be extended while it's being lifted. Stop. Next exercise, high punch plus knee kick. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try doing a simple high punch. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent to avoid joint problems. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, Spartan push-up. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try doing a regular push-up. 
Be sure to keep the abs constantly tight to avoid burdening the spine. Do not strain your neck by trying to look forward. Always stare at a fixed point on the floor. Do not bend your back or lift your hips. Your head, shoulders, and hips must always be aligned. Stop. Next exercise, standing knee touch crunch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Don't arc your back, keep your abs tight. Avoid violent impact with the floor during the descent. In order to do this, always land on your toes. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, tricep dips, outstretched legs. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this motion, try bending your legs at 90 degrees. Be sure not to extend your elbows while bringing the torso down in order to avoid the straining of the arms. Keep your abdominals tight during the entire exercise to stabilize the spine. Stop. Next exercise, standing cross crunch plus front punch. Three, two, one, go. If you are unable to complete this movement, try slowing down the pace. Do not strain your neck, stare at a fixed point in front of you to help you. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, tricep dips on floor. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, rest your butt on the ground when you descend. Keep your abs tight to avoid injuring the spine. Don't turn your elbows during the descent to avoid damaging the joints. Don't over-rotate the pelvis. Focus your effort on the relaxation of the arms. Exercise, full standing twist. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. They should constantly be in line with your toes. Keep your abs and butt constantly tight to maximize the effectiveness of the exercise. Don't lift your heel off the ground during descent. Keep your foot constantly well placed. 
five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, sumo squat. Three, two, one. Go. If you can't do it, try bending less the legs. Be sure not to raise your heels off the floor. Don't bend or arc your back. Keep it constantly straight to avoid problems. Keep your abs tight throughout the workout. Stop. Next exercise, high punch plus front kick. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try doing a simple high punch. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards during the descent phase. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Don't curve your back during this exercise. Keep your abs and glutes constantly tight. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, squat with side kick. Three, two, one, go. If you can't do it, try doing a simple squat. Be sure your knee does not pass over the tip of your foot during the lowering motion. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go! Keep your abdominals tight during the entire execution to keep a greater balance and to avoid overburdening the spine. Stop. Next exercise, standing crunch with outstretched leg. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try keeping your legs bent and touch your knees with your hands. Keep your shoulders and head straight throughout the whole exercise. Try staring at a fixed point in front of you. Be sure not to bend your leg when you lift it. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. Next exercise, sumo squat plus full side crunch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try flexing your legs less during the squat. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. Always keep them in line with your feet.
Be sure not to lean the bust forward. The shoulders should be in line with your hips. Be sure not to raise your heels off the floor. Don't bend the neck sideways to avoid forcing it. Never exceed the tip of your foot with the knee to avoid damaging the joints. Exercise half squat plus lateral punch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. During the descent, do not take your knees over the tips of the toes. Don't turn your knees inwards or outwards. They should constantly be in line with your toes. Don't bend or curve your back. Keep the abdomen constantly tight to stabilize the spine and avoid injuries. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, side lunges with ankle touch. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try slowing down the pace. Be sure not to curve your back during the movement. Don't pass the line of your toes with your knees during the descent. Don't lift your heel during the lunge. Your foot must always be firmly on the floor. Stop. Next exercise, standing full side crunch plus side kick. Three, two, one, go. If you cannot do it, try doing standing full side crunch. Don't bend the neck sideways to avoid forcing it. in the shortest time possible. Go! Be sure not to lean the bust forward. The shoulders should be in line with your hips. Crunch with angle touch. Three, two, one, go. If you can't, try keeping your legs bent, but place your feet firmly on the ground. Do not lift your lower back off the floor. Do not strain your neck. Staring at the ceiling may help. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Three, two, one, go. Next exercise, deltoid stretching. Go. Don't force the movement. Stop when the shoulder has reached its maximum tension. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go.
Don't rotate your torso. Have your shoulders always facing forward. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching arms, chest, and shoulders. Go. Be sure not to bend your back. Try staring at a point in front of you. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching quadriceps. Go. The knee of the back leg shouldn't touch the ground during the workout. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. The back leg should be outstretched in order to stretch the quadriceps. Five, four, three, two, one, stop. Next exercise, stretching hamstrings and glutes. Go. Don't arc your back. Keep your abs constantly tight. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides in the shortest time possible. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Stop. 